I had to come back to let y'all know that we are going to be talking a little bit about the coconut oil. I got to go and take my, my supplements. Y'all already know I'm doing a, the red palm oil, coconut oil, and the black seed oil. So make sure, make sure you tune in. And by the way, I'm joined today by Miss Sasha Marsh and Miss Gina G on the show. So we will see you. Stay tuned. Say no. Peace, Sasha. peace. Taking my oils, but I just thought about this. I wonder what happened if I mix coconut water and some ambrosia. Hmm. I sound sound like a drink. Yo, this is Brother High Tim, and we starting the show. We about to pour these libations, but first we gotta water our bodies. But you know we gotta do it first. Bring them out, 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 bring them out. All right, not that hard. Bring them out, 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 bring them out. Bring them out. So I got the glasses up here for my girls. My girls is gonna join me. You know, y'all can catch them on their own show, the Gina G Project. And the right? Sasha Sasha. Well, we ain't start the Sasha Project yet. We're going to work with the Gina Project first, and then we'll get to the Sasha. But first, we're going to start by getting hydrated, and we're going to drink our water. So here's a glass for you, Sasha. Yeah! And here's I a glass for you, one. Gina. And why? Who's that glass for? And this blue one is for me. Who's that? All right. Peace, peace Miss Tarpe. Alright, so Sasha, there goes some water for you. Drink that's some enough. water with us, because we always start. We always start with water. We always start with water. Come on now, y'all get hydrated. Come on now, calm down, please. I cared to you. No, you don't to you don't got to toast me on this. The day one. the toast. Mm. Y'all some loud drinkers. Yeah. All right, let's do another bottle. Who that? It's it's good to stay hydrated. Water is life, y'all. Hopefully, y'all know that. I shouldn't have to tell y'all that, but you know we we over seventy percent water. Seventy percent water. So we gotta drink water every day. Oh, awful, awful. No, drink what a little bit more. What happens if you don't that's drink enough, water? That's if you don't drink water, you die. Don't get air, you guys. Oh man, air is even more important than water. Air yep. is more important than water and food, but we don't focus on that. Oh, my fault. We do on uh, G and J, right? Oh, you drink it. <laughs> I'm trying to get between my 16 and 32 ounces before we really get started with the toast. So now, what we're gonna do is I got one more. I'm done. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. <sighs> Y'all guys are cheaters. Mm. Mm. Guys, what is going on with the lights? Uh, Oh, some oh, thank you. Um, somebody, I think the Miss Tarpe gave us some love. All right, she gave us hearts. So I'm gonna drink a little bit I'm more water. Drink. Then we're gonna go. Please, I need a little Ready? bit for me this Only time. A little bit for you. That. Right. That's enough. That's enough now. Go. All right. We're not about to have a race. If you don't get air or water or food, you'll die. Simple. Uh oh, Aunt Carol's on the line. How you doing, Aunt Carol? Hi. We gonna be coming out to sweat soon. Remember when we went to um, Aunt Blanchard? Right, and you got your face painted? Mm-hmm. I got my face painted too. Yeah, you went up there too. So we'll be we'll be coming to see you soon. All right, so all right, fam. Now I don't know what's going on. Look, it's getting dark again on us. All right, so what we about to do so is crazy? we're about to toast. I don't know why it's crazy. We're about to toast our ancestors, but out this first. Now, I'm going to sample this. Yeah, it is a great day. Uh, e, I mean, because the rain is coming down, and although a lot of people don't appreciate the rain, I love the rain because we know it brings life. We're gonna be experimenting with this coconut water later on a little bit on YouTube. We're gonna be doing, you know, because we got to look into other alternatives because the medical. The medical facilities are killing us. The pharmaceutical companies are killing us. Hell, even the food producer companies are killing us. So, what I have to do is, Gina, Sasha, I need you to move over here. Okay. With Gina, uh, make sure that y'all can stay in the screen. Can y'all see both of them? Yeah. All right. Yep. Move. Uh oh, that's right. That's right. Once again, let me know. Gina G got her own show. It's called the Gina G Project. We going we um well actually she's she's uh writing, directing, and producing at a young age. We gotta get them started young. Now, what I'm gonna do is I got a five gallon uh safe, a food safe container, and I am going to pull a scoby out. Oh a scoby. Yeah, we're gonna pull the scoby out. Can I have some scoby? So this let me have some scoby, guys. You want some scoby. Now, what I, what y'all see right here, of course y'all know, it say apple scoby. cider vinegar, but this is the vinegar from the uh, ambrosia. Rub it on, if y'all gonna touch the scoby. We put this on our hands so that we kind of so monitor. Die. So we won't die or um, kill the uh, scoby. scoby. Right, or get some um, harmful bacteria on it. So I'm gonna yeah. pull it up and I'm gonna pull it out. <laughs> uh, this be so because fun. this one been sitting and hopefully I tested it yesterday it wasn't ready but if it's hopefully it's ready today my girls will help be able to help me judge whether or not it's ready so I'm gonna pull it out mm. no this is well this is beyond the baby baby this this is almost as big as my babies. Ah, that's rude, Daddy. Uh, that's rude. Look how that big is right that. That right there is a scope. That's that, that looks like it looks like that looks like a circle. It looks like, like, like meat to me. It looks like it does. It feels like meat, and it actually it can. Like meat. You actually can eat it. All right. <laughs> right. We won't eat it today. Right. Me we dry, you can dry it out and actually meet it. Eat eat it. And the consistency is like fish. Ah, right, so. Yeah, beautiful dollars. Go, baby. Yeah, that's that's nasty. You really? Go, be nasty. No, it's not. Yes, it is. All right, so we're gonna toast. I didn't even feel it. Yet. So I need. Me either. I'm gonna fill up the glasses and then we'll get started. And then we'll get started drinking our ancestors. <laughs> Stop making me fall, JRL. Sasha, what happens? Oh, get you what happens if our um, simply die? Nothing. They they become our ancestors. <laughs> I think so. The light. The color's good. Yeah. It smells. Smell. Good. It still smells young. It 
Yes. This one I'm gonna pull out and start the second process, but I got Please some other stuff now. to show y'all. The ones on YouTube. So those that's on Facebook with us, um, I am going to. I am going so to on, on the YouTube. Can you be quiet, please? On on YouTube, I am going to uh, show you the next step for what we're gonna do. All right, Sasha, scoot over, scoot over a little bit. I'm about to put her back on my lap. All right, so I'm getting get my girls' glasses together. Be quiet. Move this. Web. Now the danger of having young people on on the edge. They sometimes they say the first thing that come to their mind. Oh. So y'all gonna really get to check out what they have to say. About their Be quiet. Stop, stop, stop. As I tell y'all all the time, it's important that we start finding ways to get fermented foods back into our diet, back into our into our life because it's real good. When you look at traditional cultures, traditional cultures used a lot of fermented foods, a lot of dried fruit foods, and they allowed some of the bacteria and the yeast in nature to help digest the food, which made it a little bit better and healthier for them. Come over here, Sasha, so Gina can have some room. Uh. All right, so each of y'all get your glass. We're about to do our toast. I got my glass. I got All right. my glass. First, give an honor to the Creator by whatever name you choose to call it, Creator. We call on this great force to be active in our life. Here, here go your glass. And don't drink yet. You already know the rules. We toast the Creator and we say, From there, we move to our personal ancestors. It's important that we call on our personal ancestors and always remember our personal ancestors. Those individuals that thought about us when we weren't thinking about ourselves. Those individuals that kept, their, kept us clothed. Those individuals that constantly bless us and continue to be active in our life. Right? We want to call on those ancestors. We want to remember our grandmothers and our grandfathers, our uncles and our aunts that made their transition. We call on them. And we, I'm going to give you y'all family line. Listen, Miles Brown, Miss Ann, Robert and Texana Davis, Herman Brown Sr., Rosalie Tilly, Georgia William Walter, Krista Fanny Gasson, Aunt Lena, Uncle Chris. Geneva Brown. Uh, not yet, not yet. Geneva Brown. Um, uh, Cleveland Brown. Margaret Ellis. Your grandfather Cecil Ellis. Um, Wash Wash Ellis, which is uh, your father, your grandfather's father. Um, we call on our friends and our family. We call on all of them. We call on um, Jamon Jones. We call on John Fillard. We call on uh, Montague Monte Pittman L. We call on um, a Pastor Yusef Weston. We call on No More Jones X, Brown. man. We call on uh, Elder Brown. Donaldson. We call on uh, Dr. Mary Ann Williams. And all those in your family line. I hope that y'all toast in your family line. Call I, your ancestors I, out because your ancestors have, bless you. And we say, go ahead, what's the name? We say, I say, Miss, Miss Robinson. Okay. We toast and we say, I say. I say, pick up that glass, little girl. Uh, I, say. I, got, I say. Now nah, we toast. Hold on. We toast. Hold on. What ancestor you have? Oh, I would say after you. I know. You got an ancestor toasted. Who the ancestor? Peepaw. Peepaw. All right. I say. That's my um. That's that. That was the name for my grandfather. We call our grandparents Mima and Peepaw. Now and and, and I'm finding. But there's more people out there that was saying the same thing about their, um, called their grandparents that. So we toast them. Don't drink yet. You know the rules, please. All right. Make sure you teach your kids traditions, right? You know, you got to be patient with them. It's hard. It's good. Hey. I'm smelling it. You're smelling it. All right, cool. Just smell it. All right, now um, we're going to toast this moment. Today is Imani, right? Some of y'all know it is another day. We call it Imani, right? We toast this day. Because in the moment is our power. Now, we put, we um we toast our children, our children's children onto infinity because everything that we build, everything we think, say, and do affects them. So we toast them and we say, <laughs> <laughs> Now, we 
we toast any of the issues that you need your ancestors to move Stop on. Laughing. Anything that you need to be, you know, any those of you that need blessings, some those of you that need um, upliftment. We call on those ancestors and we we ask them to 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 move in in and move for move for you. You know what I'm saying to make the road smooth, not to I knock the problem it, out your way. Name. Okay, what's the name? Okay. Okay, no, she's not. All right, cool. Hey, All right, you know, like I said, it take a lot of patience to get my rubber band. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Help me. All right, now, so we call our ancestors to bless and guide us, and we say, Ashe. 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 We toasted our ancestors. I hope that you toasted your ancestors, okay? And we, we wish you peace. Power, and joy, joy, and 100 years. It sounds like You can drink now. It's good. Is it? Yeah, because yesterday we do your Do your thing with the fingers where you do the, Go ahead. Do it. Perfection. Ah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's better than it was yesterday. It's a little bit more machine. Uh-oh. What's up? What's up, sir? And look, your cousin Taj is on the line. Miss Sweetie. Everybody say, what's up, Sweetie? Hi, Miss Sweetie. Your, you don't know your cousin Sweetie? All right. What, who? Jaden's mom. Oh. What, what, Nana and Jaden. Mmm. <laughs> Toast family. All right, so. All right, now. On to the next. All right, so. We, y'all done saw the Scobie. Y'all see the children can drink the ambrosia, right? Now, those of you that some that might may have kids, what's up, Mr. Sa? Si? Those of you that might have kids, there is a subtle I there there is a uh, correlation between gut health and ADHD. Now, I'm just saying the research is being done on that right now because we just they're just now figuring out the importance of the microbiome, right? And of course, we got to keep that fed, and things like ambrosia does that, right? Things, uh, the June, the kombuchas and stuff like that. I, I prefer the June or the ambrosia because it uses green tea and honey. Let it ferment. Man. Yeah. So now, Facebook, I told y'all yesterday that I'm doing, doing it with the ginseng. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Y'all see that right there? That's that real 100% ginseng. I'm about to take this stuff right here. I'm going to get my own personal bottle. And I'm making me some super ginseng today. What? I'm going to let it sit for about... I'm going to let it sit for about 20 days. Because y'all know I like mine strong. You drunk all yours? Yeah. Alright. So, Facebook, we're about to say peace. And we're going to get to work on YouTube doing the stuff we need to do. Now... Some of y'all on Facebook, because y'all local, y'all missed. We had a, a brother by the name of Kitty Obu, Obi Awadu, also known as the Conscious Roster, right? He was in town, man. He gave a nice, nice lecture yesterday. And I'm going to cover a little bit of the that stuff that he was talking about. And I'm also going to, you want, well, okay, hold I'll on. I'll taste the red stuff. We're going to do that in a second. I'll taste that. All right, so now, um... He he did an excellent talk yesterday, talking no about way. health as well as the opportunities that we have right now as an African community, right? So, uh, hey, oh, that was sweet. Although I know she wants something. All right. So, all right, y'all look at Facebook and tell them peace. Say peace, Facebook. Peace, Facebook. I love you. Oh man, hey, yeah. hey, sir, he turned it out. He got so he got a new book out. I didn't get the new book. Right now I'm looking at the uh oh. ooh, I'm telling you, it takes patience to work with your babies, but you got to do it. Alright. Here's one of his books. I bought this Did one. I ever tell you this Longevity and Living Superfood. So y'all know I'm gonna be bringing that information. You got some real good information up in there. I'm brewing with the uh, ginseng root. Those of you that's in Columbus, because I'm only going to be able to do the super ginseng because I can't ship the uh, the gallons and the half gallons yet. But I can ship the small bottles.
but I'm only doing super ginseng in half gallons and uh, full gallons. All right, now you know ginseng is good for um, well, let's say men. Uh, it's good for women too, but men. Ooh, this ginseng here. What? Bring him out. Bring him out. Well, bring no, out, you better out. tell, you better. Bring him out, bring him out. Sasha, calm down. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, he real good, he real good people. Oh, Jaden said, what's up, Gina? Hey. Hi, Jaden. Hi, Jaden. Hi, Jaden Brown. <laughs> Actually, Jaden is a chooks. Jaden Chooks. Yep. And, uh, there's Chooks in Akron too. So Jaden mm. Chooks in the house. <laughs> so we we um y'all want some more ambrosia? No. No. Nope. You you ain't finished yours yet. All right. So family, yo, Facebook, we about to get out. We got to handle our business on YouTube because I try to keep it down to 30 minutes on YouTube, but they know I'll be running over, so they kind of expect it. So now, if you want what we're going next, because we're about to do the talk about Imani today, be sure to tune in to our YouTube station. Also, tell them about your show, Gina. Okay, so click here to subscribe and click here to watch. Well, I ain't, you can't do that on I'm on, I, I set that up for you on YouTube, right? I'm going to set that up for you on YouTube. So, I'm going to be about claiming weight. <coughs> uh-huh. And... What's, your, what's, what's the next show you're going to do? Uh, Experiment about ramen noodles. You're going to teach how to make ramen noodles? Yeah. I'm trying to get, I, I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get that out of here, y'all. But, hey. Um, all right. Here we go. So, all right, everybody say peace. Facebook again, peace. P -E -E. I peace. Love y all. Y all. Make sure you get live. Yeah. Yeah. All right, y'all. Yeah. 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 YouTube. Y'all know we're about to get busy, right? So now, the day is a money, kind of laid back day. So now, what? Let me tell you what's coming. Now, I'm doing some research on the lymphatic system. So we're going to talk about the lymphatic system a little bit, probably tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be bringing Dirty information to you from Brother Akiti. Got his recipe book. Got his living food book. So I'm going to be bringing you information from there. Mm -hmm. Right? Now. Stop. So what me and the girls are going to do, I've been hearing a lot about Don't coconuts, stop. right? Stop. So we're going to... We're going we gonna to sample some of this coconut water. Y'all want to sample some of this coconut water yeah. with me? So, no. He made all this food right here. Mm-hmm. He talked about the raw diet. Uh, Y'all know, you know I, I, I eat some raw food, but I'm not, I'm not going to say I'm going to Huh? Can I feel? Huh? Can I feel? You want to feel it? Yeah, you, you already put vinegar on your hands? Yeah. Go ahead. Pick it up, pick it up, show it, show it on the film. There you go. <laughs> My turn. Right, cool. It's so soft. My turn. My turn. Don't mess it up now. Here, pass it to your sister. There you go. This is a small piece of scoby. Because you remember, every time we breathe, every time we brew, the uh, culture, the culture of um, scoby grow. All right, put it back in the bowl because you're wasting it. Put it back in the bowl. Let me do it. It's so little. Now, like I said, now you got to you got to get your kids involved in the stuff you do, right? So now, let's say you don't have to, bro. let's say I never sell a bottle of that. Well, I don't sell it, but let's say I never I, I stop giving away the ambrosia, right? My family will always know how to make this because my girls are familiar with it. My son is familiar with it. My son even my son even know the process on how to make his own scoby. Anyway. So I could lose all my scobies, I could disappear, and my son would be able to make his own scobies, mm -hmm. and he'll be able to have this healthy drink his whole life, right? Because it's about us passing things from one generation to the next. So right now we're about to sample some of this coconut juice. Y'all know we be we got the coconut oil. We do the oil. So now we're gonna sample some of this coconut juice, right? So we just gonna it's just a laid back show today. Right, 
and trying to get my kids involved a little bit more. My daughter is playing with the Scoby. All right, Lord have mercy. All right, I'm about to get her own Scoby. Now, so I'm going to give her a little bit. I'm going to give Gina a little bit. A little bit. What do you And I'm going to pour a little bit so that you can see for yourself Facebook. I mean, um, YouTube. YouTube Yummy. Fan. He got mixed up for Facebook. All right. Who, who said it was a text? They are uh, sharing the video. They like y'all. See, it's kind of clear. All right, I'm going to pour mine into this. Y'all ready to sample? Because I never really had this. Y'all had coconut water before with your mom? Uh, no. No. Huh? No, I don't know. All right, all right, Sasha. That's enough. That's enough, Sasha. That's Sasha. That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Patience, patience, family. Patience. I'm about to drink. I know some of y'all out there laughing at me because oh, this yours. I know because uh, Vern. Shouts out to Vern Loves who all who enjoys my daughters. Just make me want to pull my hair out. <laughs> all right. What it tastes like? Go and tell the people what it tastes like. It tastes like coconut oil and, and that wet stuff and that You know what? Oil. I used to didn't like this. It's, it's been like oil. But I guess because I've been tasting the oil so long. It tastes a little bit like coconut, a little coconut, whatever. Like a little it, coconut it tastes oil. like juice. It tastes uh, like kids' uh, water. They say it has five essential electrolytes. Potassium helps recover energy and strength. Sodium and sodium balances water levels in the body. Uh, calcium, calcium essential in developing bones and teeth. So this has calcium like um like regular milk. Stop beating mm. on it, please. Stop. I'm spitting Can you can you put this in there, please? Because I guess I got to take it out of her sight. <laughs> it's crazy. And phosphorus. Enhances energy. Here. Hold on. You want some more? You don't like it? I do. But do finish it. Okay. Stop. Finish it. Enhances energy. Wow. I'm getting old. Enhances energy. Oh, I need my glasses. Yeah. Hold on. Uh -oh. Abracadabra. There we go. All right. Let's finish. For those of you that don't know, wow. my dad has glasses. Enhances yeah. energy storage and supports the absorption of calcium and magnesium. Supports metabolic systems. So, now those of you that's looking for uh, energy boost, those of you that's looking for something very healthy to drink, this coconut water, and it's not that bad. I mean... I used to didn't like it, but I think I can start drinking on this. What do you think, Jenny? You think you can start drinking on it? Yep, like it. How about you, Sasha? Could you drink on this every day? I mean, if you could, if you could take the taste of uh, Gatorade, you know, Gatorade? I don't see why you couldn't do this. And this is natural. It's cold. Let's it's see. Like this provides. This one, this one container has 50 calories. You know, um, those of y'all, you know, those of y'all that's doing a warrior diet, you ain't got to really worry about calories, huh? Mm -hmm. um, it has zero fat, zero percent saturated fat. It has two percent sodium, fourteen percent potassium. Total carbohydrates, twelve grams, four percent. No dietary fiber, of course, because it's been, um, it's just the straight water. 12 grams of, of sugar, but I don't think that would be sugar because it's a fruit. I think it would be fructose. I'm going to finish. I'm finishing this. All right. So today is the day of Amani, the day uh, of faith, right? And once again, I'm stressing. Have faith in the process, right? Now, y'all see my daughters right now. The way they are, you know what I'm saying? But because I involved them in what I'm doing, right? I could be assured that they're picking up little seeds of wisdom. They might hear a little of this, they might hear a little of that. But I think 
than the future and because through my 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 short 49 years I have seen people who have been exposed to process and I have seen them look like they ignore the whole process and look like they're not involved in the process but from my experience my personal life experience those same people wind up being individuals that not only support the process but practice the process and become leaders of the process so I involve my daughters and my son in what I do and you know what I'm saying every day because it's, it's real good for them and it's good and it's good for the culture because I'm constantly talking about culture right so although I'm toasting the ancestors and they might not really get it or they might not know how to do it I hear small little things so family Trust the processes that that, that 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 are being put in motion here, right? You know what I'm saying? Like I said, some of y'all, y'all can start including your family on a daily toast. Y'all ain't got to get up early in the morning like I do on the five days and do it, but you can do it with me. And know that when you're doing certain little rituals, that eventually your family will start picking it up, right? Uh, make a long story short, when I first start, started stop eating meat, well, first I first stopped stopped eating pork. I decided I wasn't going to eat pork. I was in college and I would go back to Akron and my grandmother would do um, meals for me. So one day I came to her and she made me a sandwich and we sat down and talked. And I was talking to her and she said, well, you're going to start eating pork when you see the price of that turkey baloney. <laughs> but I went back and she saw that I wasn't eating pork. So I would go on Thanksgiving, and I did one Thanksgiving, and I didn't eat no pork the whole Thanksgiving. So the next Thanksgiving, because my grandmother saw that what I was doing, right, and she saw that I was in process, she made me certain things that she knew that I liked without pork in it, right? And my mother started doing the same, and my sister started doing the same. So whenever I go to a function for my family, they always have certain things prepared for me. So as I progress, and I went from not eating pork to not eating meat, you know what I'm saying? My family, because they recognized and saw that I had faith in my process, my faith spilled over to them, and they started respecting my process. You know what I'm saying? A lot of us think that just because um, people don't become like us, is not working but but the thing is the thing is all you need people to do is to respect your process and in the same you respect theirs you don't have to be talking about how good your lifestyle is or how much better your lifestyle is you just live yours and let people see that you but the only way you can do that is to have faith in your process and this is how you can tell somebody don't really have faith in their stuff they always try to change you right they proselytize Right, this is why I have a lot of problems with some people with, with certain religions, right, Be or, or certain beliefs, right. They're always trying to convert you to what they believe because you converting proves to them, not to you, it proves to them. You want some clear? Excuse me. Excuse me. Yes, cool. It prove it proves to themselves that what they are practicing is true, and the only way that their faith is is yeah. proven right the only way that their money is proven is by them converting others right this process that i got y'all involved in right now is not about converting others it's about you working on yourself and you having faith in what you do right you're doing a warrior diet you, you're not concerned about who else doing a warrior diet you call in the days um, you're using the Guzu Saba, you're using your principles to mark off the days. You're not concerned about other people, right, doing the same. You're doing it for you, right? And what that does, what do that do? What do that do? That helps, that helps you in your process, right? It strengthens the process within you. Remember, all of the principles, all of the things we do, Start from the inside out, at least in G and J. It's not about the external stuff. It's about the internal stuff. And once you have faith in the process, you'll start seeing results. And other people around you will begin to, begin to see the results. And then you, you will be able to guide them 
because they will come to you. You don't have to go to them and say, hey, you need to stop eating this or you need to start drinking this. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, but yo, um, this is Brother Hot Tim. We have 32 minutes. So me and my girls, we got to go. Gina G, once again, I'm, pro I'm, I'm big up in her show because I believe that we need to, uh, when our children find something, we need to support it. Oh, That's something that they like to do, right? And it's called, for those that don't know, if you don't know the language, it's called Allure to Mastery. In traditional societies, leave my crystal alone. I see you want to put it off. In traditional societies, they call it Allure to Mastery. We got to find those things that lure our children to master. Okay? Lure, find the lures. What is it? You know what I'm saying? Push. Like right now, Cleve don't want to do it. But over the summertime, Cleve is going to be learning to code. Right now, he's learning HTML. HTML. Is that what it's called, Cleve? Right? So anybody out there that might know some stuff because he had he's he's having some problems with HTML right now, and I really can't help him with it. If anybody out there that might have a little bit of information or some sites that he could go to that possibly could help him with the problem, you know, feel free to contact him. You know what I'm saying? Um, anybody in Columbus that might might want to spend some time and might want to come to one of our meetings and teach some of the other kids in person because sometimes our kids need that personal need relationship. That. that personal relationship to build, all right? So, hey, me and the girls, we're out. Can we're a little bit over... Go ahead and say something, baby. You can't sound like my book. You just say, let's get started. You can't sound like grandma and daddy because now, you listen. I want y'all to understand this, right? This what she just said, right, is her catchphrase, right? So, I want y'all to start watching the videos. And I'm going to just help her a little bit because I'm not guiding the videos. I'm letting her do it. She pick up the camera. And she started doing it. They've been doing this for about a year. About a year. It's been about a year. Uh, Vicky. Years. They would just pick up the camera and they would just start videotaping. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to guide her. I'm not trying to force it. Right? She just started doing it. Her catchphrase is, "Let's get started." Say it's it, like, Jenna. Let's get started. And my catchphrase is. Yeah, your catchphrase is do this. Not, that's not my catchphrase. That's not your catchphrase? What's your catchphrase? My catchphrase is toast right now. Alright. I have to help her find. But I know her catchphrase already. Alright. Mm, perfect. Say it. Do that. Mm -mm. Alright. I want to do the toast. Wait this second. The coconut just my phone. Peace, family. Say bye, Mosh. Bye. Thank you for watching the video. I want you to subscribe. Click the bird right there. The fiery bird. And I also have a special video just for you. Right there. And for those that want more information about Jamie Journey, go to our site. It should be right about there.